What was once a bustling room full of noise and excitement with people collecting their bidding cards and getting ready to bid on wonderful artwork is now a quiet room with no one here. With our new day, we have auction houses around the world creating some of the most spectacular art and prices that have been seen. A lot of opportunities are happening for many different auction houses and exploring one artwork of Taktanavi here to be able to see the artwork and have that online and then you can have a chance to bid it and have it for yourself. Museums and art galleries are closed right now, but you can find wonderful virtual tours of amazing artwork, and you'll see some of them listed below where you can see artwork from your home. And here are some examples. Google Arts and Culture teamed up with over 500 museums. Guggenheim, from home, guided online tours at the famous New York Museum. The National Museum of Modern and Contemporary Art in Korea Six floors with a simple touch. And MASP in San Paolo, the Musée de Arte de San Paolo. When art is on the secondary market, there's an opportunity to sell it to another individual or through auction. So there's many different venues that you can use in order to resell your artwork. You can also have an opportunity to purchase artwork through auction and have some wonderful pieces and sometimes at a very great price. Uh, this wonderful work of Robert Ginn. I love Robert Ginn's artwork and he was such a special artist that we represented for many years. 
And this piece I purchased, it was one of my first pieces at auction at Maynard's. And I was with my dad that night and I bid on this piece and it was for $250 unframed I bought it. And now it's been appraised for over $3,000. So it is the valuation, but the joy and the beauty of it for me is priceless. The internet might have you believe that this phrase simply translates to welcome. And if you set foot inside a Chinese place of business, these may be the first words you hear upon entering. Yet, it's no mere hello or even please come in. The four characters are actually two distinct pairs of characters. Han Ying can indeed be translated as welcome. But a more literal translation would be something along the lines of, I meet you with joy. The second pair means light and to arrive. Not only extends a greeting, but it also connotates the image of daylight streaming into a room through an open door. It sells a welcoming tone in part by describing the appearance of the guest as an event. Now you can shop from the comfort of your home with auctions from around the world and add beautiful artwork to your collection. Stay tuned for next episode where we'll be talking about creating reproductions from artwork from our artists. Thank you for watching.